What's going on everyone, Juice Bags here, and welcome back to some Dungeon Defenders 2. Just a real quick and basic tutorial today, as with new players coming into the game, I have been getting this question very, very frequently, and this is in regards to matchmaking through Steam on a free account. Now, of course, if you are playing 100% free-to-play, as it is a free-to-play game, and you've never spent any money on Steam, that's how they get you, oh yeah, as you cannot add friends to a friends list through Steam. Now, of course, this is the easiest way just to do matchmaking and group up with your homies, is just click on them through the Steam friends list and join game or send an invite. Now, Dungeon Defenders 2 does have an internal matchmaking system, the Playverse system, you'll hear people uh, referring to it as, and basically, anytime you are in the same instance, as another player, you can group with them. Which means if you've got a friend you've got, well, you want to play with, but say you both have never spent any money on Steam and can't add each other to a Steam's friends list, if you get into the same instance or the same town for this example, you can then group with them from there. So if you open up your town menu, you can click on any of these players through here and invite them to a party. Now, once the player accepts and is invited to the party, you can go to a private tavern or join up as normal. Now, a few important things to note. First things first, you have to be on the same server. Now, to make sure you're on the same server, you're going to want to exit out of the game. Not all the way out, but just to the title screen. So when you get back out to the title screen, if you then go down to your options, you can check what server you're on. In this case, I am on the US West server and you'd want to make sure that your friend is on the same server as you. Now if so, you can both go back on into town, and if you see your friend there, you can just go ahead and click on them and invite them to your group and get on with the DD2 fun. Now say they keep loading into separate instances, is that's just what happens. Anytime you're trying to match make with somebody, you can't find them, you don't have them on your friends list, they're never in the same instance as you, one of the easiest ways around this is to create a player market. So if you open your game browser and go over to markets and then click advanced, you can tell your friend, okay, I made a, say, pets market and I'm going to be sitting in the pets market waiting for you. Now, after you make the pets market and hop on in, no matter what instance or what town that person is loaded into, as long as they're on the same server as you, they're going to see that match. So they, they can then load into the market and you can continue on with your dungeon defending from there. So hopefully this helps answer everyone's questions. Like I said, I've been getting this one a lot lately. So I figured I would throw this together real quick just to alleviate some of the confusion. Once you're in the market and your friend loads in, then of course you can just join them right from there. I'm gonna head back on out and go back to town and show you one more time just how to interact with that particular menu in the town itself. Alright, so we're in town. Let's say that Gunderax here is going to be the friend that I'm wanting to invite. When I just load into town, I'm going to hit escape and go to the main menu here and then just go ahead and click on Gunderax and it's gonna bring up, I can view Gundarax's shop, I can invite him to a party, or I can inspect him, or I can invite him to one of my communities uh, on PC in-game. So do your matchmaking through the in-game system, and it doesn't matter if you've ever spent any money on Steam, you're still gonna be able to play with your friends. So hopefully this helps resolve some of the questions some folks had. Uh, make sure to leave me a comment down below and I'll do my best to answer it if you all have any more questions about matchmaking in Dungeon Defenders 2. So thank you all once again and I will see you next time. Take it easy.